STEM is science, technology, engineering, and math. STEM lessons are a great way to learn teamwork, and I really enjoy all the activities we do. The STEM lessons are really fun and creative. We actually get to do the experiments rather than reading about what other people have done with the experiments. The STEM lessons are pretty amazing. I really enjoy STEM because you get to work in groups and bring a lot of creativity and it's really fun. STEM education is a new approach to teaching and learning designed to really help students acquire 21st century skills. In a STEM classroom, when a quality STEM teacher is designed a quality STEM lesson, students are going to be very actively involved, not passive participants. They're going to be challenged, they're going to be motivated, they're going to be engaged, and most importantly, they're going to be doing the thinking. And a particular kind of thinking, higher order thinking, they're going to be solving problems, completing projects, and taking on complex tasks like the ones that we actually experience in the STEM fields. What I find most exciting about doing STEM lessons is that uh, my class actually perks up when they know that we're going to be doing a STEM type lesson. They get excited about the science and math lesson for that day and they're learning while they're actually getting hands on experience at the same time. Basically what we get down to is when the kids are doing STEM they can be very engrossed because they're involved with almost the entire process. It's more of a bottoms up approach to where they understand the problem and they get time to explore and then it's just kind of wonderful to watch the questions that come from the process of exploration. When they go through and they not only understand the lesson, but they understand there's a specific purpose to the lesson. To be able to take a basic lesson and turn it into something that's a lot grander, that's a lot more meaningful, uh, is a tr pretty tremendous feeling as an educator. The collaboration that's going on is really great. You have teachers, you have the college professors, and then you have the research scientists. So they oftentimes give us the ideas and we fit that into a classroom setting. I have you know, gotten to kind of expand my horizons as a teacher and it's forced me to be a lot more creative in what I'm doing in the classroom. I kind of see everything differently now. So it's changed the way I look at you know, how I structure my school day and what I do with my kids and, and what's really important. Creativity plays a major role in STEM education. Number one, it requires teachers to be creative in how they think about instructional design. We need them to be creative in, in coming up with interesting ways to engage students' minds. But it also requires students to be creative and imaginative uh, as they try to solve problems that require out-of-the-box thinking. I think that's why kids are so into STEM because they can be creative, they can come up with solutions, they can devise problems in their own way. And sometimes there's just more than one answer, sometimes there's not a perfect answer, sometimes there's trade-offs. So what you get is you get kids that are very responsive and very receptive to the idea of, okay, let's try this. Inquiry plays a huge part in STEM education because it requires students to develop the habits of mind that really are so critical to work in the STEM fields. When they're working on a STEM lesson, in addition to them being a lot more active and taking more ownership in it, uh, it looks to me as if they ask more detailed questions about the project. They want to know more about it, and it's like one question leads to another question on it. And then the learning builds on what was done the day before so that the students develop a richer knowledge base and a, a richer understanding of what's going on. STEM is really about teaching kids how to think so that they can solve real-world problems. STEM is not only getting the answer right, it's knowing why you got the right answer. I think STEM education is so important for my students because the future job market is going to mandate that they have these skills in science, technology, engineering, and math. Part of what we're trying to do in STEM education is broaden students' career horizons. We're trying to help them see the personal possibilities that are out there for them. We're trying to open young people's minds to the possibilities for themselves in terms of STEM careers. I think that where STEM 
it goes beyond just science and math education. I think it is really helping students and teachers to look at what's happening in our area and how can we develop a workforce? How can we develop students where we're really investing in our own future? And so it becomes much more of a long-term approach and what we can do to create good thinkers, good problem solvers, good designers, and people who, who understand what engineering is and what engineering needs to be and become the, the, the future scientists that we can bank on. That's a big part of STEM education. How can we create learning environments that engender not only the knowledge and the skill, but that passion for working as a STEM professional? The most exciting thing about STEM education is watching kids get so into learning that they kind of lose track of time. It's just a great experience for them and, and really it is all about the kids and it has to be all about the kids. And so watching them learn and watching their excitement is the best thing. <laughs>